Hey YouTube, hope everyone's having a great day. I'm watching Bitcoin's price go up right now, so I'm pretty happy. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to do HiveOS flight sheets. So HiveOS is awesome. I really have nothing bad to say about HiveOS. If you're, if you're ETH mining right now uh, using Windows, uh, please switch to Hive OS. <laughs> it is a hundred times easier, more efficient. This, 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 there's the list could go on and on and on. The second I switched to Hive, I was like, oh my God, why did I not use Hive earlier? I'm so stupid. I love Hive so much that I recently, uh, let's have a look at my farm here. Uh, da, 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 da. I have recently upped, I, I sent them, uh, if you send money um, early and you like, kind of like overpay them, they give you a big discount. And I just sent them 561 days worth of overpayment. <laughs> I'm, I'm like the best customer. Um, so flight sheets. Um, yeah, pretty simple to do. Um, uh, every, every one of your workers has to have a flight sheet. And so let's have a look. So I got some uh, AMD and I got NVIDIA. I got kind of all kinds of things. Um, I, I uh, upped, I renewed my farm, uh, in, I think November. I got lucky. I, I did it right, right before like the big, big crypto boom again. Before, you know, just as we started hitting the bull market, I was like, oh, I better go buy a bunch of new rigs. And uh, now they're so hard. The cards just got sold out so fast. So I, I bought a lot of uh, AMD 5700s uh, XTs. And I was lucky to get some uh, 3060 or, um, NVIDIA 3060s when they came out. But um, okay, so let's do, a, let's do a flight sheet. So click on flight sheets. Um, so you're gonna you're gonna mine. You got to pick your pick your coin. So most likely you're gonna be mining ETH. Uh, there's I, I there's you know when it, when it comes to picking a, picking a coin right now that nothing comes close to ETH. But if, if whatever if if you wanted to pick another coin, then go ahead. Well, I'll, I'll do this for ETH first. So the first one we'll do is ETH. Um, you have pick up wallet, so go in wallets and set up your wallet, and and then you can make it a global wallet. Then you got to pick a pool. Uh, the hive pool is awesome. So when you pick a, when you go in here, click whatever's closest to you. Right now I'm I'm living in Thailand, so I would take Asia and maybe Russia as my backup. And so whatever order you put it in, um, it's going to be the one it uses. And uh, maybe I could do Europe as my third one. That's that's fine. Yeah, it's only it's always going to use Asia. It's only going to use the Russia one when when Asia's down. So hit apply. Um, select a miner. So pick a miner. I, you know I'm kind of partial to Phoenix miner, but whatever. You can pick any of these guys. So you click on Phoenix miner. Uh, oh, let's go back here. Sorry. Configure pool. No. Yeah. That's it. All right. Configure miner. So in here. You don't have to change anything. It's going to do everything auto for you. Uh, the one thing you could add, say if this was you wanted this for your uh, for your, only your AMD cards, you could add an argument AMD and then hit apply changes, and then you could say AMD, um, sorry, AMD ETH Hive Miner or something, you know, Phoenix Miner or something. So whatever you want to call it. And so once you have that, so this will this this one I've configured it only for AMD uh, ETH um, on the Hive pool, and the Hive pool is it, it is really good. Um, I usually am on the Hive pool. So just recently, I actually switched over my rigs to um, ETH uh, Nice Hash. All right, so this one here is an AMD one. So you go ahead and click Worker One, and now you're going to hit this button right here um, select your flight sheet and we'll go look for the newest one I just made where is it there it is here AMD ETH Hive Phoenix Miner all right hit apply command has been sent um, give it about yeah, about 30 seconds and it will apply itself so I usually just jump off and just wait a second um, I do find uh, for efficiency, 
if I, if I mine directly on the hive pool, I have almost 100% efficiency. If I send my, um, my uh, hash power to, say, nice hash, I find I get a little bit more errors, but it just depends. Lately, I've, I've uh, kind of wanted to, to mine a little bit of Bitcoin because uh, nice hash pays you in, in Bitcoin. So I, I switched them over a few days ago, but you know, we can switch them back right now. Okay, so let's have a look. At worker one, did worker one take? Let's come back, refresh this. Yep, there we are, worker one. So he's not quite up to full power yet. There's six of them there, so he should be about 300. I know we could just hit refresh just a few more times, and he should get up to get up to speed in a few seconds. Okay, yeah, it looks like he's getting up to speed now. Okay, so that's that's one flight sheet. Okay, let's do a let's do a dual miner flight sheet. So say you wanna you wanna mine ETH, but you also want to mine. Uh, you want to use your AMD, uh, your CPU, and so I all my rigs I, I do use um, good CPU. So I, if I want to do that, I uh, it's available. So let's see who has. There's a couple that don't like um, this guy. Yeah, this guy we can do. I think. Um, he sh let's have a look. Let's go have a look at worker two. Worker two has a, yeah, it has a 3,600 CPU. Okay. So let's make a flight sheet for him. So he's NVIDIA. What is he again? He is, he's, you know, he's running a 2080 super. Okay. So let's go back to flight sheets. Okay. So we're going to make a dual miner. Okay. So ETH, select a wallet. Hit my my ether wallet. Select the pool. We'll we'll still stick stick on hive. All right, whatever. Click click. Doesn't really matter too much. Select Phoenix Miner, and then this one was in uh, Nvidia. So I'll I'll add Nvidia as my little tag. Just double check you make sure you typed it right. Yep. Yeah, dash Nvidia. Okay. Hit apply changes. Now we're gonna call this dual miner for YouTube. Um, NVIDIA, right? And if I could type yeah, NVIDIA, and I didn't even type YouTube right. Okay. So before you hit create, we need to add a second miner. So the coin number two is going to be XMR. You can select a wallet. I already have my Monero wallet in there. And which pool was I using? I haven't done it in a while. Um, which pool was I using? Uh, I think, yeah, I'm using support. So go ahead and hit low difficulty and select a miner. So you want to hit um, this one here. Let me just double check. Is there any? No, there's nothing to change. No, nothing to change. Um, I've tried to limit the CPU threads. Like if you use nice hashes, uh, miners, you can actually limit, like if you use their software, you can limit the threads. So say I, this is a 12, uh, 12 core, is this 12 core? Yeah, 12 core, 24 thread. So I, I could like limit the threads on nice hash. You can't do that on here, but it doesn't seem to affect it too much. So, um, hit apply changes. Okay. Now our, this guy is going to mine ETH and it's a NVIDIA card. We, 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 we told them it's in NVIDIA in, in here. And it's also going to mine XMR on a different pool uh, with the CPU. All right. So let's click cl create flight sheet. All right. Let's go back. So this guy here has, um, let me find it. Okay. Click here. And let's go find that dual miner that we just made. Where are you? Do a miner for YouTube and video. Okay. And we'll hit apply. Let's have a, give it a refresh. Click on number two. All right. It's thinking about it. So it, right now it's setting up the 12 cores, zero to 11 of the uh, CPU. Okay. So give it a few more seconds. There it is. So Phoenix miner. And XMR, dual mining. All right. The third one I'm going to show you is how to um, mine on NiceHash. Uh, because if you try, maybe you might you tried before and you couldn't figure it out. So what you have to do is 
you have to type, you know, you can't, you won't find it in his, in this list. Okay. It's kind of weird. I don't know why, but you just type nice hash and dash ETH hash. There, there it is. Okay. So for some reason it just, it's kind of hidden. I don't know why. Um, go ahead and click on nice hash. It auto does it. All right. And you can configure in the miner. But they already have it in here. So let's just say, oh, okay, I'll do Hong Kong because that's the closest. And then maybe India. Sure. And then you're going to, again, just pick a miner, Phoenix. And uh, we'll just leave that open. So maybe I can use this for my AMD cards and my NVIDIA cards. It doesn't matter. And you could actually... You could actually set up a dual miner, same, same, um, send that hash power to nice hash because they, they'll take that, um, your CPU hash power. But just for this example, you know, we just did it. So I'm not going to do it again. And then we just call this nice hash, uh, for YouTube. Okay. And I'll hit create flight sheet. All right. And then I'm going to go back and click here. And I'm going to send worker one back to nice hash. So you click up here and go find nice hash for YouTube right there. Click on that, hit apply. So you see now uh, I was mining when I, when I started the, the video, we were mining like about 1500 um, mega hashes to ETH hash, but now it's separated. So we've got 370 here and 1150 here. Now we're also mining uh, XMR. Okay, so click in here and boom, it's back to ETH hash. It hasn't ramped up to 300 and some odd yet, but it's coming. And uh, yeah, that that's how you do it. So flight sheets aren't hard. Uh, again, Hive OS is really easy to use. Just don't be scared. Just dive in and just go for it. It is way easier to mine with nice hash. I mean, with a uh, Hive OS. Um, yeah, the the cost. Don't uh, don't pay the three percent. Just pay them. Um, where is the billing? Um, mm. Oh, you gotta set it up. I think you set it up in settings, but uh, when you set up your when you set up your account, don't pay them the three percent. Pay them uh, per per rig, and your first four rigs are free anyway. But if you if you mine on um, the Hive OS pool, and the Hive OS pool is awesome. You know they pay you every day. Well, every time you you mine a point one, which my my uh, my guys mine about 0.1 a day so 0.1 eth a day so i got 30 gpus and they're all pretty new gpus so they i get about 0.1 a day so uh you get paid every day you get paid in, i get paid in the afternoon and yeah it's great you know it's getting like i get a little paycheck every day so uh i'm still loving the mining i've i've, I've started to do uh i've started to do cardano uh pool, a pool operator uh if you if you're uh, into cardano and you want to join our pool um, our pool is called learn and we'd love to have you, but uh, until proof of work is dead, let's keep mining that ETH. All right, thanks for watching the video. If, you, uh, if I gave you some value, please smash the like button, and I'll see you in the next one.